Hello, my name is Linda, and I work at the MIT Media Lab with the New Media Medicine Group. I help researchers explore how technology can help individuals take control of their health and communicate most effectively with their coaches. We focus on prevention and collaboration is key. In fact, you may have noticed that I never mentioned the words patient or doctor. We believe that the elimination of this asymmetry will be critical in forming successful therapeutic relationships. Julie and her physician coach, John, have successfully controlled her diabetes with diet and exercise for five years. Recently, they have decided that it will be beneficial for her to start a medication. Julie and John choose which medication is best for her and when it best fits in her day. They are using Collaborithm, a platform that allows teamwork to continue even when they are apart. Julie keeps track of her medication through a number of synchronized devices. Collaborithm lets Julie keep an online diary of her health condition. It's like a personal blog about her health. She can record her symptoms, track her progress, and analyze her long-term performance. Connected with all communication devices in Julie's life, Collaborithm helps her and John contact each other anytime, anywhere. Julie, I just took a look at your stats and I wanted to let you know that you're doing a great job. Your good exercise habits and your medication adherence are keeping your diabetes under control. Keep up the good work. This positive reinforcement helps Julie keep up with her regimen. Julie has been doing great for over a year but she recently had an injury to her foot that is beginning to cause her concern. Her blood sugars are rising too, and she doesn't understand why, because she has been taking her medication. Normally, she would let it slide for a while, but her relationship with John has been enhanced with I'm Listening, a program that provides her with instant access to me, her virtual relational agent. She can start a conversation with me during commercials. Hello, Julie. Hello, Linda. What can I do to help you today? I've had a sore on my foot for a while now. It's painful and it isn't healing. I am sorry to hear about that. Can you show it to me? Eventually, I will have seen enough diabetic wounds to help in the evaluation. But my main role is to facilitate human-to-human -human interactions in healthcare, not to replace them. Back at John's office, he is remotely taking care of another patient. A message is delivered to his screen, requesting his attention regarding Julie's case when he is free. John reviews the data from my interaction with Julie and her personal history. He concludes that her rising blood sugars are a consequence of wound infection, rather than failure of her diet, exercise, and medication management. John's notification is queued on Julie's message system, reaching her almost immediately wherever she is without disrupting her daily activities. Hi Julie, I scheduled you for an appointment at 5 p.m. today. Your foot wound looks infected and I'm gonna take a closer look at it. Thanks to the help of Collaborism and I'm listening, Julie and her coach work as a team, preventing disease progression and trips to the ER. A great deal can be done to allow the individual to make a difference, not only in his or her own health, but in the entire healthcare system. Advances in collaboration and communication will be critical, and prevention will be the goal. I am glad to be a part of the solution. Thank you.